Um, one of the funniest things that I remember um, from the time we've known each other was actually just a few weeks ago in our rec league B level basketball game where we were clearly outmatched every game and you for some reason deciding to talk crap to a guy twice my size probably about a good 250 probably a good 610 611 and you were talking crap because uh, I don't know about too many elbows being thrown this guy's this big you're this big and I it was so hilarious that you were arguing the ref about it and I don't know, it, it was a, one of the funniest times I couldn't even control myself on the court. Um, but if that ever happens again, because we're playing this fall, you know, I got your back, and uh, talk crap all you want, and we'll, uh, we'll take care of business. So congratulations, Rob. Um, hope you have a uh, very good future with Stephanie together. And they had dollar horse rides and dollar camel rides. And remember that one time you fell off that pony? That was just a dollar, too. Hey Rob, what's up buddy? Blake here again. I just wanted to let you know first off, congratulations for this day. Now, one other thing that I thought was just absolutely fantastic, just thought of this, you and I used to play basketball together. It annoyed me so much how you had such an awesome but weird hook shot and you made it every single time. Now I may be tall, but I can shoot here and there, but that hook shot got me every single time. But regardless, I still love you, man. So I hope this is a great day for you. And with that, I got your back. Well, Stephanie and Rob, coming from a guy who's been married for 12 years, I have a little bit of advice. Compromise, compromise, compromise. And if that doesn't work, Robert, just admit you're wrong. That's all I've got for you. Uh, good luck and be merry. Robert, Stephanie, one more piece of advice. Get at least two TVs. Robert, so you can watch your sports games whenever you want, so it doesn't interfere with Stephanie watching Hallmark Channel or HGTV. I know it's really helped in my relationship with my wife now that we've both gotten our separate TVs in our separate rooms. Life has been much better. Stephanie and Rob, I just want to say congratulations and I wish you the best of luck in your marriage. Um, what I have for you is a simple piece of advice that I learned from my parents and that is that <laughs> Put yourself in the verse of 1 Corinthians 13, where you say, you know, Stephanie is patient, Rob is kind. Um, if you put yourself into that, you will learn a lot about yourself and a lot about working better with each other. So I really recommend that this is something you think about and that you work with in your own personal life because it will make your life a lot easier along the road. And Stephanie, I just want to do a little reminiscing with you while we have a, while we have a moment here. Um, I just want to recollect on the days of when we would work overnights together and you would be at the group home, we'd be texting each other back and forth all night long, trying to keep each other awake because we're both bored out of our freaking minds and, and then we'd uh, start texting back and forth to see who got to go get the morning caribou on our way to class and you know, it was always caribou, it was what our morning run was and it was always the, well, whose turn is it and you know, bottom line is, I really caribou about you. <laughs> Dollar brats, dollar popcorn, and my personal favorite, dollar Charleston chews. Mmm. Hi Stephanie, hi Rob, congratulations, I'm so happy for you both. I hope that in 25 years you're as happy as you are today. I uh, just want to bring a couple, couple memories up to you Stephanie, mostly involving food, but <laughs> Some of my favorite memories of you has been, have been when I first got to know you, when we used to take our AOPI lessons together and giggle uncontrollably and bother Sarah, <laughs> and maybe at our first AOPI formal when we went up to the bartender and asked for Shirley Temples and they asked us for IDs. Yeah, well, they still haven't learned how to make a Shirley Temple, but <laughs> just want to help let you guys know that I am hoping for you guys to succeed in life and don't. And I'm, I love you guys both. Action. So, last 4th of July, Stephanie, you came out to my house and you saved me from my crazy environmental uh, co-workers who I invited up to go swimming. And we were in the water, I remember that really clearly, and I was just telling you, Stephanie, thank God you're here. Thank God you're here. I don't know what the heck I would do talking to these people all day. And then we went and watched fireworks afterwards on the boat. They were popping up above us and we were laying on the on the boat and just, you know, having my sister's dog squish us to death. <laughs> I hope
hope you and Robert can come out again this year and you know we can make a couple modifications maybe not the crazy environmentalist and maybe not the crushing dog this year but it'll be a lot of fun again hey Rob I just want to say congratulations on your uh, wedding uh, hopefully it all works well just remember you got to communicate with each other and for when you do drink a lot yes I will make your big bowl of Cheerios that's all I have to say Robert I know you love sports, but uh, remember you do have a wife and a dog now to take care of, so make sure you pay attention to them. Robert and Stephanie, congratulations. Wish you two all the best, and we love you. Hey, Steph. Hey, Rob. How are you guys doing? Um, I just wanted to say congratulations. I'm finally getting married. I hope you finally give me some nieces and nephews soon. Um, I hope you guys have a great life together. Um, I don't really know what to say, but <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Make lots of pretty babies. <laughs> and what it all comes down to, in all seriousness, is I'll always be there for you. Even if I'm in Peoria and you're in St. Paul or Roseville or wherever, you give me a call, I'll be there. We love the both of you and we wish you, wish you well. <laughs>